A South Korean research team has developed a type of technology that effectively removes the fine dust in subway stations. It's a filter-free air purifier that can process a lot of air at once and is expected to be effective in various public spaces as well. Jung eun has the details. On days fine dust levels are high outside, they get worse in subway stations. This is because the constant flow of outside air adds to the dust from wear on the tracks and natural ventilation is limited. Last year, the average concentration levels of ultrafine dust at subway platforms nationwide were 29 micrograms per cubic meter, the highest among public facilities. Purifying air in closed spaces can be done quickly, but special equipment is required at places like underground stations because there are many contributing factors. A South Korean research team has developed something that can purify more air at once by actually removing the filter of an air purifier. Negative electrons that come out of the electrode at the top of the purifier stick to the fine dust floating in the air. This makes the fine dust negative and stick to the bottom of the purifier, which is then positively charged and only clean air flows through the purifier. Unlike conventional methods, filters don't block the airflow of the newly developed purifier, so it can clean 1.5 times more air in the same amount of time. Filters also deteriorate as fine dust accumulates, so they need replacing, but this technology maintains its performance of removing more than 90 percent of fine dust. The research team says the new technology can be applied to existing air purifiers by only improving the filter, so it's cost-effective. It costs nearly 4,000 U.S. dollars per year to replace filters per station. So for 500 stations, this saves $1.9 million. The research team applied this technology at Taejeon's Yusong Spa subway station. They also plan to install it in tunnels with running trains to check changes in air quality. The new technology is expected to be used in public facilities such as movie theaters and large restaurants to improve air quality. Jung Eun-ju, Arirang News.